Hey guys, it's JV here again from InfoHut and today's video is a quick one and it's something that a lot of people have approached me about as a repairer that their phone tends to get a bit hot. So let's go through a few things and let's see if uh, your phone needs to be looked at by a professional or it's a normal thing. So let's divide it into two categories. The first category is your phone getting warm versus getting hot, which is a second category. So your phone getting warm can sometimes be a bit of a hit and miss type thing where it only heats up on certain occasions. And it's a very common thing, so rest assured that when you do have a warm phone, all phones do this. I'll give you examples of when you'll notice your phone tends to get a bit warmer than usual. Uh, if you're playing games on your phone, if you're uh, using GPS, if you're doing these things and your phone's ch plugged in on charger, if you're watching streaming services, if you're doing stuff like watching a lot of YouTube and your phone's even in a case that's, that's real protective and you're, you're doing a lot of these things, your phone will warm up. Now, the phone's operating temperatures ideally around the 35 degree mark and under or 90 degrees Fahrenheit for those in the US. So rest assured when you do have a, a, a warm phone and you stop using any of these services or games or apps and it actually does cool down quite quick and then you just go on to using your phone as you normally would, like say through Messenger or, or uh, basic things like sending texts or even making a phone call, that should be something that once again, doesn't get warm or doesn't tend to, to heat up as much. Now the second category is hot and the great thing with iPhones is most iPhones, as long as they're not faulty, will let you know if a phone is overheating. So for example, I'm in Australia and uh, the temperature here is, is quite crazy and uh, it, it at times if you leave your phone in your car and you go to use your phone, you'll get a warning where it says bam, uh, high temperature, phone can't be used until it cools down. So that is when you see something overheating. Now, you might even get those warnings and your phone's not hot, that's very rare, and uh, it possibly could be something like a battery or a motherboard issue. Now, if your phone tends to get hot when you're using it normally, even using it on YouTube, maybe even playing games but not extensively, and it does get really hot by touch, then you might have to look at possibly taking your phone to Apple or a technician for them to look at it. Now, I can't make any assumptions on what could be wrong with your phone where you do feel it's overheating more than normal or uh, it's operating at, at a temperature that's not normal, but the most common things I see, especially with older phones that people have had for a few years is, the first thing is the battery. When the battery goes and it's on its way out and it's just about to die, the phone tends to overheat. And uh, you'll see also some, some other similar uh, type of symptoms of your phone not charging uh, or your phone not charging fast. Also your phone losing charge fast and uh, a, a few things that, that do pair with that type of overheating error. Now, another common thing is possibly water damage on your motherboard, moisture could have gone in, the circuitry isn't running as efficient as it usually would, so therefore you'll get uh, parts of the motherboard, especially around the CPU, overheating and certain types of capacitors and, and stuff will get really hot. And that obviously reflects on the the body of the phone. Now, they are the two most common issues. Sometimes it can be around the camera area. If the camera is faulty, you feel around where the actual camera is, and then you'll see, oh wow, it's hot, and when I try to turn the camera on or use a flash, it gets really hot to touch. That can sometimes be a faulty camera. So I, I really suggest that, one, you just uh, simply try to monitor it and see if it only happens on certain apps like games, Netflix, etc. And when you stop using it, it's fine. But then I'd be more concerned that your phone gets hot doing 
even the, the smaller things like sending messages. So if it does, once again, make sure you, you check out with Apple, see if it's under Apple Care. Maybe they can even uh, assist you with uh, resolving your problem or uh, possibly seeing a local repairer. So I know it's a very short video and it's a very vague video, but there can be so many things and uh, I'll definitely try those things out and I'll definitely just try monitoring what I've suggested and then working from there. Uh, if you're a bit confused, drop a comment below. I'll be more than happy to reply. And uh, once again, thank you. Please like, please subscribe. I always have videos uh, with tips and tricks. And uh, thank you for watching. Bye.